Hello guys and welcome back once again to the Asian channel. And today we are going to talk about China just showcased a new air-to-ground missile for the J-20, showing the world that the J-20 is not solely an air superiority fighter in electronic warfare and stealthy reconnaissance missions. The J-20 is known for its long-range and standoff capabilities through the use of its powerful radar and extra-long-range PL-15 air-to-air missile with a maximum range of 300 kilometers to keep the J-20 safe from a distance. But it seems the J-20 is also capable of ground strikes and multi-role missions as well. The Tianlong-20 or TL-20 family of precision-guided munition was unveiled at the UMEX 2024 Defense Expo say in Abu Dhabi, UAE. The precision guided bomb can easily fit into the J-20's internal weapon bay. The J-20 is a very capable stealth fighter that's designed for air superiority missions. Aside from its low radar signature, the aircraft is also equipped with advanced electronic reconnaissance and surveillance capability. It has also powerful data processing computers and sensor fusion technologies that can control other unmanned systems and direct other manned aerial platforms and serve as tactical airborne command and control. With the J-20's low radar cross-section, the J-20 could utilize the precision guided bomb effectively. The TL-20 is similar to the US GB-253B Stormbreaker gliding bomb. It is designed to be used by the stealthy F-35 as well. Over the years, we continue to know the capabilities and missiles that is meant to be used by the very secretive the J-20 program. The TL-20 glide bomb has an estimated range of 85 to 95 kilometers with a speed of Mach 0.9. Looking at some images, it seems the glide bomb has a size of 1.8 meters long with folded wings, 0.22 meters wide and 0.24 meters high, which is enough to fit into the J-20's internal weapon bay. It seems the bomb can easily be retrofitted so that it can be carried by other Chinese fighters like the J-10, the J-11, the J-15, the J-16, and even the light attack aircraft L-15 and JL-10 as well. The J-20 has three internal weapon bay, two side bays, and one on the underbelly. The two side bays would not carry this missile as they are only intended for the short-range PL-10 visual range air-to-air -air missile. The side bays are specifically designed to bring out the PL-10 and then close back while the missile remains out to retain a high level of stealth and allow the pilot for high-G maneuvers on close-quarter dogfighting. At this point, the pilot can fire the missile anytime he wants while staying stealthy and with almost no maneuver limitation. With the J-20's 4-meter internal weapon bay on the belly and with a TL-20 size, it seems the J-20 could carry 12 TL-20 glide bomb while retaining the aircraft's stealth capabilities. The TL-20 uses a satellite-guided navigation. It uses China's Beidou navigation system for inertial guidance and target recognition. Giving the missile almost same accuracy to U.S. GPS-guided bombs, it has also infrared and millimeter wave radars for better accuracy and for target engagement on strong electronic warfare jamming environment. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you want more topics like this, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you soon.